Hey guys, Kingdom Builds here, and today I'm actually going to be doing my um, 501st, small 501st Army uh, custom review. So, uh, yeah, there are, most of the figures are completed, there are two that aren't, and there's one that is technically done, but I should update them, but I just want to get this video out of the way, and it would take too long just because... Um, I've been wanting to actually do this, uh, small army for a while now, but, uh, yeah, let's get into the individual figures, and here we go. Okay, so, um, let's get started with the leader of the Fiber First, Captain Rex. Um, this is the Phase 1 clone trooper. Um, so he is custom, except for the, uh, weapon, which is a Brick Arms DC-15, uh, Rifle, which I think is honestly just too awesome. It, it, it is really, really nice. So, if it focuses, there we go. Yeah, it's just too epic. So, um, I made him have that. And then, yeah, this is just the standard Phase 1 Rex, which you see him throughout most of the Clone Wars. Um, just a regular clone head. with painted uh, helmet so and then he does have <coughs> real metal so and that which is cool so if I take that off um, this is like real oh man whoops This whole thing is just basically a fabric uh, pauldron. It's pretty cool. I didn't attach too much metal just because I didn't want to make it too big. But, yeah. So then, obviously he's got real fabric. Which wraps around the legs too. All the way to the back. Metal. Crotch plate. <coughs> Pouches, which I kind of messed up on. But, you know what? It's fine metal on the arms and then it's cool obviously more pouches a back to tank which I just left gray and then a small like little backpack thing for him which is you know really cool so let me put him back together so um yeah that's Captain Rex um I didn't put his uh <laughs> two little pistols just because um, I wasn't sure how I wanted to go about making them, so, but, um, yeah, next one is a 501st, uh, Airborne Trooper, so, just basically a standard Airborne, Airborne Trooper, nothing, like, special, just, you know, painted in blue, fabric, all blue, um, all that. And he does use the episode 3 clone head, not the clone wars head, but, um, and I put, like, two little ammo things, which I'm not sure how well you can see in the camera, but there are yellow on each side. Gives it kind of like a shell type thing, which is really cool. So, um, there's that one. This one is just a 501st ARF Trooper. Um... Custom, I forgot, I got these helmets off eBay, just has a regular black head. I got these helmets off eBay, I don't remember where I got them, but, yeah. And then, some of the paint chipped off, I have to fix it. Little backpack, back to tank. Cool stuff. And then, a 501st Jet Trooper, this one's based off of the one from um, Star Wars Battlefront 2. He wasn't completely finished, I didn't paint the pouches, but I can just do it. He's got a green visor, not sure what you can tell in this lighting, but all the way to the back. And he's got a, um, no pouches because of the jetpack. I kind of want to paint the jetpack, I kind of don't, but no, still pretty, pretty cool. So... Uh, 
uh, next up is Boomer, our trooper Boomer. He's um I'm not gonna go into too much detail on him. Just painted because I actually have a review on him that I did last year. He was actually my first ever custom review. So yeah, I'm not gonna go into too much detail on him. Just that's Boomer. Um, whoops, one fell. But um, phase one five oh first trooper with a custom DC fifteen blaster. Not much to look at, but. You know, it is cool. And then pouches, the uh, knee pads, all blue patterning goes all along the helmet. More pouches, blue. I really went on an overload of blue on this one, so. But, um, you know, he looks cool, so. And then, pretty sure this one's Echo. I actually don't remember. Um, he's not done. He has a uh, DC-15 blaster. Not the, the the one that Rex had was the rifle. This one's the blaster from uh, Brick Arms again, which again looks super cool. So um, there's that. He's got a custom red, just a regular red visor. Um, I <clears throat> might shave this down. I'm not sure. Again, he's not done, but. Uh, yeah so there he is and then next one that I was starting on I only managed to finish the helmet was Sergeant Kano um yeah clone war said and all I really did was just paint the helmet which wraps around all the way to the back so he's not done he literally just has a painted helmet so there's that and then this one is a <coughs> Clone Army Customs Phase 2 um, 501st Trooper. Uh, I painted that and then put the metal on him. He's not done. He was almost done, but. So. He looks cool. So it's kind of like a in progress video, I guess. But, um, yeah, there's nothing much other than that. But, um, now we look at that. Uh, I really actually am a fan of those two uh, fighter tanks. Um, I'm not sure why, just maybe visually cool with like a small army, I guess. Um, so, yeah, I just basically decided to make those two a part of their army. Um, I might switch the little tile, the cheese slopes, with blue just to make it more fabulous first. But, um, yeah, I could have put the uh, clone turbo tank. I'm actually looking at it right now, the uh, 2016 16 one, but eh, I figured not. I actually like this one. But, um, yeah, guys, so that's my small but uh, sl very slowly growing uh, 501st Army. Um, let me know what you guys think. Let me know what figures you guys would like to see me next. Maybe add on to this army, or maybe you want a completely new army. I'm not sure. Um,. <clears throat> that's just so far all I've got um pretty sure I have more I just am not a fan of them I've got other like I've got a I forgot what Grease Battalion are but I have a few of those um I have one custom Kashyyyk Trooper which is cool I might do a review on them but um yeah guys just let me know what you guys think of these uh clones if you want to see me make more leave a like down below um again the two fighter tanks which is cool so I might just leave this for a little bit just so it can be the thumbnail but um yeah guys that's gonna be it for this video um leave a like down below and comment down what you guys want to see maybe I can make another army um small army because again clones are <laughs> very hard to come by now just because they're making all new Star Wars sets and stuff like that I actually have a cool resistance trooper I might do a review on him but um yeah guys it's gonna be it for this video and I'll catch you guys in the next one